Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, you already know who this is. This is your boy, Mr. Yee, Yee from that No Limit Hauling and Junk Removal. You know what I'm talking about? And look, and look what, let me see, uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Do, you see this right here, you see? Storage clean outs. If you don't advertise it like this, if you don't advertise and let everybody see your menu, how are they gonna know what you gotta, what you offer? They can see junk removal, but if you got a menu like this in the back of your trailer or truck or whatever, or even on the side of it, at all angles so people can see what you offer. Do you see this? This this is a, people ask me, what should I do first? First, you should look at all my videos. Then like and subscribe. You know what I'm talking about? And watch all my content, because I'm giving you guys all the recipe. Look at this. But you know, look at this. When someone's behind me, they already, oh, I got a storage. I don't want no more. Boom, bam, done. Boom, bam, call or text. But anyways, your boy, Mr. Yee Yee. And you know, today, it's been a nice, beautiful day. It's been a nice, beautiful day. You see already behind me what I'm doing right now. It's been a nice, beautiful day. You know, today, before 9.30 a.m., we already had two jobs done. I didn't show them because I'm, I don't want to show you guys everything that I do anymore like that. You know what I mean? Because I've already showed you guys everything that I could show you. But I do. You know what I mean? But today before 9.30 a.m., we already had two jobs, 500 already. Less than a half an hour of work. You know what I mean? And now one of my corporate accounts, one of my corporate accounts reached out to me and said, hey, Mr. Yee Yee, we got two more storage units that need to be cleaned out. You already know what time is it when you see this. You already know what time is it when you see this. When you see these things broken off and sawed in half, you already know. So they reached out to me and said, we got this unit. We need you to clean out. We need this unit to be fully cleaned out. There's some hidden gems in here. I'm gonna tell you right now, there's some hidden gems in here. You know what I mean? This was somebody who never came back. Who never came back. These chairs are nice. These chairs are real nice. It's a blue one, two red ones, and a blue one. Nice. But there's a few hidden gems in here. We're going to go through this and, and clear this unit out and get this unit ready to bring in more revenues for the next person. But, you know, this is one of two units that we are cleaning out today. You know what I mean? We're cleaning out two units while we're here and more money more money so you know you know what i mean it's, it's been good all week you know we gotta i'm trying to do a go last week we had you know last week we had over seven almost eight thousand dollars in revenues last week you know what i mean just in last week with the huge house clean out everything so much money you know what i'm saying this week man i'm trying to reach over ten thousand when you get over those, when you get those $10,000 weeks, those $5,000 weeks, those $4,000 weeks, those $3,000 weeks, it doesn't matter. It's making money and you're the boss. You're number one in control. You don't work for no one. You're in control. You're number one in seniority. You're the boss. So that's what we're, we're trying to do over here. I'm just a guy with a truck and a trailer, as you see, a truck and a trailer. And, you know, I'm getting money. And that's just how it's working. People are asking me, what should I do? How should I do this first? First, get your name out there. Let people know who you are like this. This this uh, a, a, a corporate account right here reached out to me after I came here and hollered at them and presentation and represented myself the right way. We got it. And now, look, every time they have a storage auction, every time they have an auction here and they sell off these units and everybody leaves what they don't want, they call Mr. Yee Yee, and you know, we're trying to we're, we're, we're trying to get more money, build our brand, build the name, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going, till there's zero limits, zero limits, where we're getting those ten thousand dollar weeks. There might be haulers out there who are already getting ten thousand dollars in one day or in a couple of days. You know what I mean? But but for Mr. Yee Yee. For Mr. Yee Yee, that's another goal for me during this summertime. Summer, today's the first day of summer. Today's June 20th. Today's my brother's birthday. Happy bruh. Happy birthday, bruh. Bruh. My bruh's over there in the East Coast. He's in New York. He's relaxing. He flew out to New York to go handle his business, have some fun with his with his peoples. I love you, brother. Happy birthday for Mr. Yee Yee. He watches too. So anyways, you know. 
But we got some goals for the rest of the summer. I want $10,000 weeks. You comment below. For, make sure you like and subscribe first. But comment below and how, let me know how much money you made this week or that week. Or what was your best week? How much money did you make in one week so far during this summertime? Today's the first day of summer, so the phones are going to start ringing. Man, it's just been nonstop for us. But, you know, you're with Mr. Yee Yee today. And, you know, we've already had a beautiful morning. $500 less than a half an hour of work. I went to the dump already to unload this trailer. The other trailer is full because we've been nonstop. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. But you know, corporate accounts are going to keep you busy. Corporate accounts, repeater clients are going to keep you busy right now. I'm telling you, so many referrals. So many referrals. We have this whole week is booked up. We are booked this whole week and taken. I'm taking, I'm already booked up almost every day this week. I have a job or two. But I'm taking these little or other smaller jobs that keep on calling me in and say, hey, I got this. And, I, and I'm making them fit because I got that big boy right there. And you know, out here, we do camel hump loads. Camel hump, Beverly Hillbilly style. But you're with your boy, Mr. Yee Yee, on this corporate account. You know what I mean? Getting this storage unit at one out of two. And you know, we're going to handle this one. Then we're going to go handle our other one. And you know, half the stuff... I'm going to be able to uh, donate and uh, give away to my scrap metal guy. And guess what? I, I did a pickup the other day, and I trusted one of my repeater clients. And I trusted this client, you know what I mean? And he had a box, and he gave it to me, and I threw it in my trailer. And look, there was a can of paint in it. That's why I always go through the boxes, always check your boxes, always check the bags, because this could happen to you. It's all dried up now. But man, I'm trying to tell you, you know what I mean? That's why I always go through all the boxes, always go through all the boxes, always go through all the boxes, all the bags, because there's so many hidden gems and you don't want to run into some situation like that. But you know, just some game from Mr. Yee, Yee. We're going to start knocking this out. We'll get back at you and let you see how we're taking it out. And you know, two storage units already, it's going to be a thousand dollar day for your boy, Mr. Yee, Yee thousand dollar day baby that's just how we're doing it i'm letting you guys see what we're doing today on the first day of summer june 20th 2024 in that bay area in that 707 yee yee okay so the perks about when you're cleaning out these storage units, I try to tell you guys, there's so many hidden gems. You don't know what you're going to find. Look what we found. Look what we got today. What does that look like? What does that look like that we found in one of these boxes buried? Oh, 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 oh. there's some jewelry. There's some nice gold right here. That's probably at least $100 worth of gold right there. Just $100 worth of gold just right there in these three rings. Wham, bam. You know, we're going to take it. Then some uh, school rings, probably silver or white gold with some kind of diamond in it. Another gold. This one's pretty heavy right here. Another gold ring, school ring or something like that. It says 14 carat on it. So, you know, a $78 coin, you know. And we got some other situations, some silver necklace down here. And we got some, some watches. And we also... This is, this is kind of nice right here, but, uh, you know, these spoons right here are from Japan. They say Japan on them, and I think they're gold-plated. They say stainless steel on the bottom. Stainless steel, so they're probably going to be gold-plated. I'm going to bring these and go get these valued, you know? And, of course, there was a bling-bling watch, but we all know that this ain't, this ain't, you know what I mean, what you think it is. But it might have a little gold on it. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know what kind of watch it is, but uh, um, uh got a little uh, bling bling on it. A nice cool, a nice cool pocket, a nice cool pocket watch from the from the uh, Air Force, Air Force men. Uh, you know, probably silver. You know what I mean? So, you know, we get these valued, but, you know, hidden treasures. Some hidden treasures, some money for free. Mr. Yee Yee found the jewelry box in the storage shed. Hello. Let's go. More money. Hello. 
Yes, yes. There you go. That's all done. Storage number one. Got about a quarter load. Got a bunch of cardboard. My favorite. Freaking hate cardboard. But you know, got a bunch of scrap metal. Got everything. Some things on top I'm going to keep way up there. But everything else we're going to throw away is no use to me. Is all right there. Then we have some scrap metal all right here building up. Because the next storage is a lot of scrap metal. So, you know, there you go. Mr. Yee Yee. First storage uh, uh, a unit clean. Now let's go to the other one. You see that? Oh, boy. That's, the, that's why they call me. Because we get the brooms out. We sweep. We, we do everything. We get Look at that thing. It's ready now. They already know. When I finish my job, it's ready to go. Just like that. You already know. Look at that. Look at that. We'll get back at you. Let's get to the other storage unit. Let's close this bad boy up. And let's get to the other unit. And let's wrap this job up so we can wrap our day up. Yes. Yes. Oh, boy. So here we are. We're in our second second unit. We're cleaning this unit out. This is our second unit. And, you know, it's just happening just like that. We got the No Limit truck and trailer pulled up. Our second unit right here. And, you know, we're cleaning out all these debris right here. All these debris, all this stuff. This stuff. I think that's a trash machine or a service machine. I don't know what that is. But you know, it's gotta go with us. And trust me, it's going with us. Scrap metal guy is already on his way. All these shelves, all these metal shelves, all these metal shelves. Easy money, let's go. You're with your boy, Mr. Yee Yee, getting that money today. You know what I'm talking about? Second unit, commercial accounts, repeater accounts. I don't know how many times, I, how many storage units I've done cleaned out here, but you know, they just keep on going and going and going. And the hidden gems, oh yes, those are a bonus. Yes, yes, we'll get back at you. All this scrap metal from my guy, come on now. We'll get back at you, you already know, Mr. Yee Yee. Yes, yes. Just like that, you see that big old load, full load. One full load, two storage units, one full load, just like that. We got all the cardboard getting ready to go to be recycled. I'm gonna give all this to my scrap guy. Empty out half of this trailer right here. Yes, yes, you see what Mr. Yee Yee just did? Just like that, empty that whole second unit out. We'll get back at you, but you already know, Mr. Yee Yee. And there you go. Unit number two done, cleaned out, done. Ready for revenues. This security unit has been storage for so many years. Now they want to rent it out. There you go. Mr. Yee Yee got them ready to put this in revenues tomorrow. We sweep it out crispy clean everything. And now look at that trailer. Another full trailer load. Second trailer load of the day. We've been having four. We have two trailers all week full. Just like that. Another trailer loaded. Some more money. There you go. And I just met, you know, you see this. Uh, look at this thing. Look at this thing. And you know, that's just what we're cleaning up. That's how it's supposed to look. And your boy, Mr. Yee Yee, just met the general manager of the district. So he has, they have about three or four in each city. And he said, do I go to Sacramento County? Do I go to Contra Costa County? Do I go to Vallejo? Do I go to everywhere they need me to be? I said, I sure do. He said, guess what, Mr. Yee Yee? <coughs> you are a new guy for all of our facilities. I'm the district manager. So I wanted to come meet you personally today. And that's exactly what he got to meet today. He got to meet the No Limit, Mr. Yee Yee. He got to meet Mr. Yee Yee in person. And I met the general manager, district manager of all of these uh, 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 storage units. And guess what? I got it. And I just, I already have this one. But now I met the general uh, district manager of all of them. In Northern California. And guess what? Mr. Yee Yee just sealed the deal with them. So that's what I talk about when I tell you guys to get those commercial contracts. Because you never know, a small job could lead into a big job. And I remember the first job here was a small clean out for uh, somebody who was renting a storage unit, but they needed it to be cleaned out. They called me because how I came in there and met them and greeted myself and gave them a presentation of what I do. <clears throat> and now look, I just met the district manager of Northern California for this place. And now he said, Mr. Yee Yee, you're the one we're gonna be using for all of our all of our units for Northern California. Just like that. Yes, yes. There's some knowledge for you from Mr. Yee Yee. We'll get back at you. We gotta get going, but we'll get back at you. Yes, yes. Yes. So with that said, today was a beautiful day. 
We had three jobs today, over a thousand dollars. Easy peasy, just like that. You guys got to see what your boy did today with those storage cleanouts. I didn't record my earlier jobs because I really wasn't going to make a video today, but then my corporate account called me and said, Hey, we need you. And just like that, I said, okay, well, let me get on deck and show the people what I do. And you know what Mr. Yee Yee did today on this Thursday. You know what I mean? I hope everybody enjoyed it. Before that, before that, RIP to the legend, Willie Mays, the Say Hey Kid. It was a tragedy the other day when I heard the devastating news that Mr. Say Hey, the Say Hey Kid, number 24. They should, the, the uh, MLB should retire that number 24, just like they retired 42. They should retire that number 24. You owe it to him. To me, he's the greatest player that ever put a glove on and hit a ball. Willie Mays, 93 years old. And man, that sh it hurts so much. I'm a, I'm, I'm a diehard, born and raised in San Francisco, San Francisco Giants fan. And when I heard that news, it hurt my heart. It hurt my heart. R.I.P. to the legend, Willie Mays. Oh, man. Rest easy, Willie. You did so much for the Bay. So much for San Francisco. So much for Candlestick Park. A lot of you guys call it those other names, those corporate names. Uh-uh. I'm old school, just like that. Candlestick Park. The home of the... The home of the... San Francisco 49ers and the San Francisco Giants. Yes, yes. With that said, you guys were with Mr. Yee Yee today. We had a good day. Another two trailer load day. All this whole week we've been having two trailer loads. Easy peasy money. We got another trailer load tomorrow. The phone keeps on going off. We are booked all week. It's a blessing. It's a blessing. People are knowing who we are. Our community is knowing who we are. The social media is knowing who we are. When people type in junk removal near me, boom, I pop up because I got all those Google reviews, those Yelp reviews, and I keep on getting them just like that. You guys got to see what we did today, some of the hidden jewels we found today in those storage units, just like that. And now, you know, that's a day. Mr. Yee Yee has to take his hat off and relax. You know, make sure you like and subscribe. I hope everybody got money. I hope everybody's getting money. I hope everybody's phone is going off. You know, it's summertime. Today is the first day of summer. Again, my brother's birthday, the first day of summer is today. So let's go. Promote your businesses. Promote, 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 promote. Advertise, advertise. Do what you got to do to get your name out there so that phone will be ringing. There's a job for you. You know what I mean? If you want it, go get it. Work hard to get it. Don't think it's just going to come to you. But yes, yes. You know what I mean? There's so much money in this trash and junk removal business. There's so much money. There's so much money to get out there. But you guys were with Mr. Yee Yee today. It's been a long day. It's time to hang it up. You know, but I did this video for you guys today. Just a little something, something. You know what I mean? Because I, I, I like junk education videos now. And, you know, showing you guys the good content, talking about good issues, talking about very good content to help you guys and give you the recipe to start your own business and to keep on going and be number one and be your own boss and never, ever again have to report for duty to anybody. This is your boy, Mr. Yee Yee, out of that big seven. Uh-huh. Yes, yes, yes. That seven. But yes. You know what I mean? I'm going to leave you guys with that. I hope everybody had a good day. It's none but love. Once again, rest easy. RIP to the legend, Willie Mays. But today, we showed you what we did. We hit a home run today with junk removal for the Say Hey Kid. And just like that, yes, yes. Everybody have a good one. And, you know, let's go. We got some more days to get money. It's not over. It's not over. Let's go. You got way more days until Sunday gets here. Let's go. Let's go. Mr. Yee. Yee.